Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Sierra and welcome to today's video. If you're new and you're seeing this video for the first time out of all my videos, go watch a different video first and then come back to this video. I don't want this video to be the first impression that you have from me, so please do that and then come back. <laughs> a lot of you can probably guess from the thumbnail that I am COVID positive. I just wanted to update you guys and let you guys know that Sierra is all good <laughs> I am still recovering I did do a live I believe Monday Monday or Tuesday I think it might have been Tuesday I did do a live on Tuesday or Monday I can't remember I did let you guys know that I tested and it was positive I did remove the video just because at the time I was I was pretty sick and a lot of people wanted to voice their opinions on that video. If you don't believe in COVID, that's totally fine. That's your opinion. When I'm sick and dealing with it, then I don't know. I, I, I don't care. I don't care if you think it's not real, okay? I don't care. <laughs> Just don't comment that because I don't want to read it. I don't want to read it while I'm sick. So please, please just don't do it okay so let's move on on friday the 21st of january i started to feel when i woke up it was like a little tickle like an itch in my throat but eventually went away so i didn't think nothing of it i was like hmm, maybe i just maybe i just slept weird i don't know and then saturday that was when everything hit me <laughs> so saturday i had a sore throat i was very fatigued i had a headache i what else was there yeah, I think that was the symptoms I had. Just like cold-like symptoms. I felt like something was up. I went and got tested. Still the same feeling on Sunday. Very fatigued, cold-like symptoms, in bed, whatever. Got my results back. I was negative. Okay, cool. You know, I was like, maybe I just have a cold, whatever. So I just realized as I'm editing the video right there, <laughs> I forgot to mention this. Just because you get a negative COVID test, but you still have symptoms does not mean you're in the clear please continue to stay home if you do experience symptoms just to be safe and keep those around you safe i could have possibly tested too early i don't know there's so many different variables but i just wanted to hurry up and mention this in the video monday comes around the 24th and monday i experienced a new symptom which was me being very um how do i explain it confused or just brain fog i believe that's what they're calling it where you know what's going on but then at the same time you're kind of lost and you kind of lose the thought of it so that's kind of how i was feeling so that's when i knew that is when sierra knew <laughs> that's what i knew it got me i was like oh my gosh i it got me it got me covid got me I, I know it. I know I have to be positive for sure. So Monday, I ended up getting doing the test, the at-home test, and it came back positive. But obviously, because of my symptoms, I knew I was positive, and at that point, I was just like, okay, I guess I'm positive. I know I'm positive. Oh, well, whatever. At that point, I was kind of over the fatigue. I was over me wanting just to be in bed. Now that it is Friday, I'm currently experiencing congestion, mainly in my throat area. I don't have a sore throat anymore. I'm coughing. I experienced a new symptom last night, which is um, I lost my smell, which is very weird. I must say that it's very weird. I don't know how to explain it. Um, I was cooking dinner last night and then I noticed I was like, wait, why can I not smell this dinner today? I'm st I still I still have no smell today. <laughs> so that was my newest symptom. I feel good most for the most part on a scale of one to 10, 10 being my normal self. I probably feel about a seven. The things that I have been doing to help me are I've been drinking a lot of liquids. I've been taking my vitamins. I already take vitamins in general. I know a lot of people said to take zinc and vitamin C and D. I'm already the type of person who takes those, so I still continue to take them. One of my good friends dropped off some sage and Navajo tea, so I've been drinking that. Otherwise, I feel like I'm, I'm okay. Um, my breathing is fine. Everything else seems pretty normal. It's just... Um, 
I don't know if you can tell in my voice, but I'm a little congested in the throat still. Otherwise, I'm good. And for those of you who are going through this, hang in there. We got this. We're going to get through it. And I know a lot of people are going to be asking this, but my roommate, Jeff, he's fine. Buster's fine. Jeff did also test positive, but he didn't have any symptoms. His symptoms were very, very, very mild compared to me. But he is perfectly fine, so thank you guys. I'm not trying to make this video too long. I will see you guys in my next video. Hopefully next video I will be good to go. <laughs> I will be better than I am now. So thank you guys so much. I will talk to you guys later. Bye!